Good morning, Minneapolis St. Paul. Um, I'm Dr. Jennifer Harrington, and I'm doing a, a really interesting, I think, education case this morning. Um, I'm taking implants out for a patient that um, is concerned that she has uh, breast implant illness. So a big part of that is taking the implant out with the capsule, um, ideally end block if you can. Um, and she's also a gal that wants a breast lift. And so that can be somewhat of a difficult operation. Um, and it's really important that you know you go to a surgeon that kind of just knows what they're doing. So I kind of wanted to show you what I was doing today. So I've already done um, her right side. All these markings you see are for her breast lift that I'm going to be doing, um, but I've already taken her implant out. Um, one of the keys in my opinion to this operation is um, if you kind of come over this way, this, this, this breast still has her implant in, um, but instead of making my incision below and interrupting blood flow to her nipple, um, I actually just used my lift incisions, uh, created my, my breast flap, and then I was able to dissect out uh, her entire implant uh, end block with capsule. So what you're seeing here is, is implant with just capsule. Uh, one of the things I think that surgeons struggle with is they sometimes take breast tissue with the capsule and that's not a great idea because it leaves the patient not looking so great and not having the volume that they could have but i just wanted to show you the end of this dissection so again going through my my um my incision for my lift i think is is really kind of interesting and clever to do i've been doing it now for a while and uh, i have my great helpers here in my operating room that make my job so easy but I just wanted to show you the end of this dissection so I have implant scar tissue no additional breast tissue and then I'm going to just gently tease the rest of this capsule off of her pectoralis major muscle um, not interfering obviously with hopefully the good fascia that's on that muscle as you can see she's got just a nice good healthy muscle here with her fascia on it and again this is just the end of my dissection I thought it would be kind of fun for you to see this um, in its entirety so here we go we have uh, implant implant removed completely and block okay and uh, soon enough, I'll come back to this. I will make sure she's nice and dry. I'll put a drain in and I'll do her breast lift um, and hopefully get her restored to a place that she feels really good about. Uh, more importantly, hopefully she's gonna feel uh, much better with having these implants out. So if you come back with me now, uh, you can see that um, uh, this is my back table. And what I'm gonna do after I do this is I'm gonna take off my gown and gloves and and kind of start over and start fresh. Um, but I think what I'll have you do, Rach, is come on over and help me out for a second. So um, this is her left side, I just finished it. Uh, this is her right side, which I had done previously. Um, the difference that this is a little bit wider really doesn't mean anything. They're both taken out with, with no additional breast tissue, which is wonderful. So now what I can do on the back table is I can just, um, open up this capsule uh, you can see that she has a textured implant inside um, I'm gonna sneak this out again all on the back table sometimes if I see anything funny or unexpected I'll take cultures um, this looks pretty standard uh, for this case um, she has some white residue so I might take cultures because I've been finding that sometimes I'll find like a biofilm or a bacteria that they'll grow out but this is a saline implant, it's textured, it is intact, um, it's an Allergan uh, implant. So, here we go, we have our implant, intact, textured, saline, and then we have our beautiful capsule, okay? Um, again, one of the values of an end block dissection is that you don't really, if there's anything within the capsule, you don't really contaminate uh, the field, which is wonderful. So I'm gonna open up this capsule and see what we have in here and again uh, we have a saline implant uh, it is a allergen implant it's intact um, you can see the valve there 
I will be taking some cultures for her with this just sort of white stuff. It may or may not show anything. This capsule is a little bit more, a little bit more what, we, what I call calcified. It's pretty brittle. You can see it's pretty firm, um, but completely intact, end block dissection, uh, really nice for her. Um, so what I'll be doing at the end of the case is just taking some pictures for her. Now, again, I'm gonna take a few cultures. I'm gonna change my gloves, my gown, and then get back to my operation for her. Back in with uh, this this uh, really educational case. I just want to show you really quickly at the end. We have her briefly sitting up. Um, what I'm looking at, she's got really healthy nipples. Uh, it looks a little weird right now, but she'll round in and, and really take great shape. So we are all done. Everything looks really healthy, and she's doing fantastic. Have a great day.